Tammy Duckworth was born in Bangkok, Thailand. Her father served in World War II and his family served all the way back to the Revolutionary War. Following in her family's footsteps, Tammy joined Army ROTC in 1990 and became a reserve officer in 1992. She chose to become a helicopter pilot because it was one of the only combat jobs open to women at that time. In 2004, Major Duckworth was deployed to Iraq as a Black Hawk helicopter pilot. She was one of the first Army women to fly combat missions during Operation Iraqi Freedom until her helicopter was hit by a rocket-propelled grenade. Major Duckworth lost her legs and partial use of her right arm in the explosion and was awarded the Purple Heart for her combat injuries. Despite those injuries, though, she sought and obtained a medical waiver that allowed her to continue serving as a lieutenant colonel in the Illinois Army National Guard. Following her recovery, she became the director of the Illinois Department of Veteran Affairs. She worked hard to create a tax credit for employers who hired veterans, established a first-in-the-nation 24-7 crisis hotline for veterans, and developed programs to improve veterans' access to housing and health care. In 2009, President Obama appointed Tammy Duckworth to be Assistant Secretary of Veterans Affairs. She led an initiative to end homelessness among veterans. She also created the Office of Online Communications and worked to address the unique challenges that female veterans face. Tammy Duckworth has had many firsts in her tenure. She was the first female double amputee from Operation Iraqi Freedom the first Thai American woman elected to Congress, the first woman with a disability to be elected to Congress, the first double amputee in the Senate, and the first Senator to give birth while in office. Thank you, Senator Duckworth, for your continued service and everything you do to help our nation's veterans.